I'm Cookie DiOrio, and I have taken on the task of producing a video series that celebrates the legacy and contribution of black American vocalists of the opera stage. If you are receiving this, you have been tapped as one of my special agents, and it is your new mission to download, devour, and disseminate this message. Downloading will commence in 3, 2, 1. Download complete. Barbara Conrad was a mezzo-soprano born in 1937 in Centerpoint, Texas. She first gained the national spotlight in 1957 during her undergraduate study at the University of Texas at Austin when a controversy over her being cast the role of Dido opposite a white Aeneas led to her dismissal from the production. This incident would catalyze her to fight for diversity on university campuses in Texas and nationwide. She would go on to sing roles in many of the greatest houses in the world, including the Vienna State Opera, the Teatro Nacional in Venezuela, and an eight-year engagement with the Metropolitan Opera. She would also be very successful on the concert stage, singing with prestigious orchestras and conductors including Lauren Maisel, Leonard Bernstein, and James Levine. On a personal note, when I was an undergrad, I had the great fortune to share the stage with Ms. Conrad. It was the first time that I had a professional gig with professional artists, and the first time that I was on stage with another African-American opera singer. I remember being enthralled by her presence, completely in awe of her voice, and hanging out in the wings to catch every moment she was on stage. Barbara Conrad, African-American mezzo-soprano, Activist, role model, leader, educator, legend.